Can we get it? Oh, we got it. Snag the overtake on him. That was nasty. What is going on, everybody? Welcome back today, guys, to the channel. Gran Turismo Sport is officially back on the schedule man fanatic has hooked us up with the podium f1 racing wheel package that allows me to run this on the playstation 4 pc and the xbox one all on the same wheelbase so i'm really excited right, to be able to take this wheel say and pull this right out with the f1 wheel and we can toss this directly onto the base with our playstation buttons if we wanted to run the open wheel setup so today though we're going to be running uh the nascar wheel for this one and i, I want to get a first test first impressions on this brand new wheel for a little bit of drifting we're gonna do a nice little build here today take it online see how we can do against the pack but this is gonna be a lot of fun huge thanks to fanatic once again uh for sending this thing out but right, i honestly love the way that this thing looks with the blue carbon inlay on the weave um it is it is a piece of machinery man i'm really excited to get this going and bring back gran turismo on the channel because obviously i mean gran turismo is something that i grew up with as a kid and i love gt sport and uh, the fact that i haven't really played it too much is definitely a little bit upsetting so we're back today let me know in the comment section what you guys want to see down below from gt sport in the next coming days but we're gonna have some fun man I'm really excited for this one today we're gonna go ahead pick a car do a build thank you guys so much for watching and of course don't forget to slap that like button if you guys were fans of the channel way back in the day the first thing i do we go to the muscle car section man let's see what we got for a little bit of chevys i think gt sport has a chevelle does it I wish it did though, but we got a Camaro. We can definitely toss around a Camaro. Okay. Ooh, one LE package. Super clean. Only 79 grand, actually. We can test both of these out, man. We can go old versus new for today and see how they do on the wheel. We're gonna go definitely old first, and then we can kind of see how the new one compares. And of course, dad joke to start us off before we get going here. Jeremy Hill and he goes, Dad joke, what's the difference between a hippo and a zippo? One is really heavy. And the other is a little lighter. Oh my god. Right, I see what you did there, sir. Big thank you for watching. Big thank you for commenting. Leave your dad jokes down below. Um, I don't know what color I want to make this. I'm thinking orange, to be honest. There's that classic Camaro orange. Uh, we're going to go ahead. 100 grand. Eh, this is quite expensive. It's probably US dollars too, man. Jeez, do the conversion. That's, that's a lot of Canadian dollars right there. Second car for actually less money, more horsepower, Camaro ZL1. 1LE package 2018 this is gonna be really nice man i'm a big fan of this thing also too i did post my f1 2020 my team episode 2 yesterday uh fully oh no i didn't i didn't mean to get into it Ooh, i love how it starts it up and i forgot about that jeez keep it going this guy's still going Please keep that. How? What? I've never heard one go that long before. That is that is absolutely insane. 5:33. Okay. We're gonna go to the uh, driving park here. Five layouts. I think we're gonna go with the 4.25 on the far right. Swing this old girl, man. This is gonna be right. I missed coming to this game. I really did. Right, so the fact now that I can run the Xbox, PS4, and the PC all on this right rig is definitely a huge improvement. And I can't wait to put more time into this, man. Really, though, racing, drifting, uh, you know, drag racing if need be, right? But I think this is going to be the new Forza for a bit, man. Forza just hasn't really been cutting it for me. And, I, I mean, I don't know. I just haven't really been, you know, feeling it at all. Um, you know, even Forza 7, there's really been no need to hop on Forza 7 at all. And gloves getting put on the wrong hand. Did you see that? Hopefully you didn't. Another big thing to note for today uh, is the new shifter as well too man fanatic right they did some big moves for me i do appreciate it but they sent me the 2019 limited edition shifter uh with the carbon fiber knob on the end of it uh just a super clean setup all right so just a huge thank you uh to them for hooking that all up for me and oh wrong buttons it's crazy though that the xbox layout on the oh what did i do the xbox layout actually works with this which is which is pretty crazy um so there's our different, yeah, okay. Now to get to these, I do believe uh, we're just gonna, yeah. And then down, so traction is now turned off. I don't know if I want, ooh. Okay. Instantly can feel this wheel right now. This is, this is super nice. Let's just bring it down here. 
Oh, well, handbrake. The handbrake works too right off the bat. Oh, shit. Okay. Oh, I think I've fallen in love with Gran Turismo Sport again. Let me try to make this. Oh, no. No. I haven't had any shifting issues yet, also. As you guys know, that's been a big problem for me going into neutral through the shifts. But now I think it's going to come down to just finding that good tune. No, understeer, understeer. Oh shit. Brakes. Brakes! I don't even have the high torque chip in yet, also. This is all on low torque. Which, I don't know, I feel like the low torque sometimes is better than the high torque. I don't know if it's just me or not, but... It just feels more like power steering, in a sense. Oh yeah, okay. Let's just settle this down, because I don't know if I'm going to save it. corner too. Oh, no, no. Ooh. At least we're killing these tires over fourth. Bring it down a bit. That's all this thing likes is fourth gear. I'm having big fun with this car right now, but I don't know how the day. Oh, oh, oh! I don't know how the new Camaro is going to beat the old Camaro. I really don't. Ooh. Well, test drive day today, man. Let's give it a toss. And I'm just maxed out. I'm just mad at full gear. Sending it in. Oh. Oh, what? That scared the hell out of me, man. I was not expecting my own ghost to pop up. Well, here we go. Oh, yep. Yeah. That's all me. This thing. Right, this is the newbie right now. If we had a proper setup, though, with the actual diff, though, I feel like this thing would be nasty. I'm gonna do two things here. One of which, ride height, let's bring this way down. We're gonna bring these down as well, too. We don't need that much camber, I don't think. We're gonna go 60 60, see how this feels. And we're gonna go with the full transmission and let's see how this is gonna do. I, I really don't know how that's gonna change it, but. Oh, dog box setup. Okay, we're gonna take off traction once again. Brake balance, let's move that to the rear. Did I have it to the front last time? I don't know. It's weird. Okay, here we go. Oh yeah, there's no more clutch now. It's weird, whenever you go to that, it just takes away the clutch. I don't understand. It's the weirdest thing I've seen. I don't know if you guys can explain that in the comment section for me. I mean, it definitely makes you better. You don't have to worry about the clutch at all. But it's just the weirdest thing that you don't have to touch the clutch anymore. There's autopilot on here. Grass tandems ever hurt. I love this corner though on this car. Go fifth gear. Now we can start linking. Oh, outside, outside. Big flick coming in hard, hopefully. Oh no! Yep, yep. Okay, we're gonna quickly hop into our Camaro. We're sitting real deep in the chair too, eh? Damn, okay. I hate, I hate when we can't move ourselves in the car. Ooh. It does feel pretty good also though. We we'll probably look a little bit better in this thing, I feel like. I don't know, what's your taste, man? Old versus new. Personally, I love them both. third gear eats, man. 
little bit of the dirt there. Try forwards here. Come on! Oh. There we go. I'll try hood view out. Gets me. I feel like not today though. We need to get online. I'm ready. I think this thing's good to go. To one more nice corner here. Oh no! There we go. Just a little bit of transmission issues. It's brand new, it's okay. Here we go, man. This game just gets me hyped, though. I don't know what it is. It just it feels so satisfying. I was watching one of the streams that uh, GT Sport posted when uh, it was the one-on-one -on -one battle. Just insane. We had Jimmy Broadbent commentating. Just an insane matchup on that. And, uh, oh, man, it got me so hyped to start playing more GT Sport, though. Ooh. So we link this. Second gear. Oh, look at the angle on this thing. Why does it have so much angle? There's no drift springs in here, man. It's not Forza Horizon. Okay, we're bringing it in, coach. We're bringing it in. Oof. Looks good, too, man. Oh, shit. I didn't think we were actually going in. Let's go, baby. Oh, my God. That was a fast. Okay, that was fast as hell. You guys are good. We definitely need to watch that last lap though, because we killed it. This one? Maybe this one. Ooh, man. Like, why did they have so much angle coming around that? Huge entry though. Absolutely nasty. I love this car. I'm glad I picked both of them up and not just the one and stuck with, you know, just the American muscle. The old school muscle, sorry. We went new and old school. Look at the weight transfer though, man. This game is just, it is so beautiful to watch on and off the track. When you're spectating, when you're driving, there's just something about GT Sport the way that they do the games. It's just, it's, it's beautiful, man. It really is though, right? I've been a huge fan of this ever since I was a kid. And uh, of course, I'm not stopping anytime soon, man. GT Sport will live on forever. They're, probably won't ever be a PlayStation that won't ever have a GT on it, right? It's going to be GT all the time, man. This game will never die out. I love it, man. GT Sport, we're back, man. I'm so excited to be back in this game. Truly, though, I mean, I, I really did miss this game, man. I really did. We're joining this one here. No BS, man. BS equals kick, okay? Have fun out here. Oh, these guys are throwing it down here. Hopefully, I can, uh... <laughs> What do with it? Big throws. Oh, they're gone, they're gone. This dude got a truck? He does. The third gear. Oh, I'm a big fan of this thing. Right with him. We're gonna try to get the overtake. Actually, this thing's a little too fast. We got it. We got it. Oh man, I like this thing. Where my horn is, though, is the only thing. I'm gonna stay nice and far back. Oh, that's BS right there, man, with this truck. I'm running in the back here. There's a lot of people. I almost stalled it. Shit. I got the stupid backwards thing on my screen too, but I hate that thing. Oh, we got damn cops out here too sliding with the, with the bars and everything. That's super cool. 
got the full light right on the door. I just seen that. Pull it up to him. Ooh. Brakes, brakes, brakes. Yeah, okay. Look at everybody, man. Holy. Sun's going down, too. What a banger lobby this has been so far. Oh, no, no, no. Good sideways. There we go. Can we get it? Oh, we got it. Snake the overtake on him. That was nasty. Oh, we're back. We're back, man. What a dirty overtake that was. Try and get next to this cop here if we can. Oh, we got the damn speed, too. It's getting sketchy. We're on the yeah, We're on the steering hard. Oh, boy. There's trucks, man. There's cops in here. Thought there was no BS, right? So we'll take this in the interior. Alright, that hood view is nice and all, but sometimes you gotta go interior mode. Let's get that full effect. Oh, did I make him? Oh, right there. We're on the sergeant's door. Damn, man. That was wild. We got the officer behind us here. Oh, he's right on my door. I see you, sir. Oh, no. We just get the... Oh, the Corvette. I don't even know what happened. Don't even know what happened on that. We got a little bit hectic. This is wild. I miss GT sport lobbies like this. Also, too, the community is just, there's just something about the GT Sport community. Oh, what? What is that man driving? I just bullied him right off the road, too. I'm so sorry. I mean, what are you doing bringing that thing out here? Sorry, sorry, sorry. Oh, my God, I'm doing it. I'm right. I'm going to lead it. This nice and clean for him. If we can lead this out, but I'm gonna head out on this one here. Oh yeah, big time. Big fan of GT Sport, man. We're back, baby. Episode one. It's a new chapter. This man's getting on my door. Let's go. Damn, that was good, man. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you guys so much for watching today. We're gonna be back. For a lot more, man. Damn, man. What a pack this has been. Full lobby out here, it seems like. Tossing some big trains. Huge thank you once again for watching for today. And of course, we'll see you guys back here tomorrow if we get another episode. Man. Just a teaser for today, man. Right, if you guys are not already, subscribed with post notifications. And I'll see you guys back here tomorrow for another episode. I'm out. Peace.